Hey guys, today we're going to install 6.39 custom firmware on uh, PSP Go with 6.39 official firmware already installed. There, as you can see, 6.39. And now, what you're going to want to do is download the file in the description, unzip it, and extract the files to the desktop. Um, I'll, just, I'll show you that. see uh, fast recovery and pro update you want to select just those two and extract them to your desktop I already did it so I'll just go to the desktop all right there they are right there pro update and fast recovery what you want to do is find your PSP mine is disk I for my system storage, that's my memory card, you'd probably rather do it on system storage just to be safe. Go to PSP, game, and drag both of those in there. And that's it for that. And there you go to your system storage. The update and start it up. And I just previously installed 6.39 official firmware, is probably why you saw it. So, alright. You're going to want to press X, or just to be safe, hold L and press X, and it'll install all the stuff, all the files it needs, and then you just hit X to start, and that's it. It's hacked. It has all the files installed on it. It won't, if your PSP shuts all the way off, or it dies for some reason and forces itself to shut all the way off, then you'll have to run that other folder you put in there, fast recovery. Right, we can just delete this. Fast recovery will very quickly rehack your PSP if it turns all the way off or if it dies and has to turn all the way off so or if it crashes if a homebrew doesn't work or something. Uh, as you can see, it'll work. I'll show you with, uh... Here's a, another competition entry. Just a game. See? Runs perfectly. I don't know if this is signed already. I mean, it could be, but... I'm not really gonna go any farther. I don't want the video to be too long. Yep, so it works. If you guys have any questions, comment, message, uh, subscribe if you want to be updated on stuff like this. And that's it. See you later.